Hello, my name is Andre Salia. I'm the marketing manager at AECI Plant Health. We're doing a series of videos on how to take leaf samples for leaf analysis. We're here in the fallouts area. I'm going to show you how to do it on peanut plants. This is a peanut plant. If we look down here and we pull out these plants, you'll see that they've reached the stage that we call pegging. These are the pegs with the peanut developing below. If your peanut plants have reached this stage, the leaves that you need to sample are the youngest adult leaf. If we look at this plant, we'll see this is the growth point. This is an adult leaf. So this is the leaf we take. Important, we don't, we don't use the petiole. We only use the four leaves, like that. We're going to need 25 samples like this for a peanut field. These you place into a dry paper bag and keep them as cool as you can. Don't let there be any moisture in the bag. If you need to keep them overnight, leave them in a fridge or a freezer. Next day you can send them off to your laboratory for, uh, for the leaf analysis. If your peanut plants have not yet reached this pegging stage and they're still young and they only have roots, then you're going to need 15 entire plants for your leaf analysis. So not 25 like the previous one where you've got bigger plants like this, 15. In a case like that you'd cut the plant off there, just above the roots, and you're going to need 15 of those for your leaf analysis. Same procedure, dry paper bag, in a cooler, tomorrow you send them to the lab for analysis.